Hi, it's Ashley from AB Sound Advice. Today we are unpacking something pretty special. This is the Mydex. Wow, from Audio Physic, and this is going to be special. And these are in a black ebony, high gloss. And in this part of the world, they're around the 30k mark. You did hear me right, 30k. And if you think that's expensive, these guys go right up to 100,000 for the top of the range. But for us, this is going to be very special. And we have Benson with his knife, and I guess he's a little worried. You certainly want to want to put a mark on a pair of $30,000 speakers. So there's no stress. <laughs> <laughs> so today, Benson and I are going to unpack the first pair of these in NZ. I think Australia have already received a set, and we've heard back that they think they're fantastic. But for us, for... Good old New Zealand, this is the first pair ever in this country of the Mydex from our friends at Audio Physic. And our mate Benson will be in the background. If old, he's going to get the knife rolling on this and he's put his blade away a little bit more this time. He's thinking, I'm not going to put the, the whole blade in this time, just in case. So you can see him being a little careful. Um, definitely had a bit of weight to them. I don't know what they weigh, but uh, they definitely were a nice, reasonable lift. Would you agree with that? They weren't light, were they? And if you haven't heard of audio um, physics, you know that there's no loss of fine detail and also nothing but the music as their taglines. And uh, again, last year we did the Step 35s in the bookshelves and they were absolutely sensational for detail. And now we are playing with um, a model that's very famous around the world. I mean, the Mydex, um, I know a lot of people have heard of this model and there's a lot of happy people around the world who own these. So we are today going to experience the unboxing of these. And to be honest with you, I'm really looking forward to this German-made product, the drivers, everything's their proprietary product, made in their own factory. And I think he's now ready for me to give him a hand. Which way are we going? My way? So, um, we, no, no, yeah, no. so we're going up. Here we go. Oh, shivers. And and again, two hands on the top of these. I'm just giving Benson a hand to get them up, and he's just making sure they don't pop out of the box on them. <laughs> just taking the extra precautions. And I'm putting my fingers in here and see if I can help him a little bit at the top here. Yep, here we go. Here we go. It's on its way. And then we'll just help him with this box and come over here. Sorry, guys. We'll just slide that away. And there he is now with the speaker in its up sound down mode. Look at this, and while he's doing that, actually, I might give him a hand. He's fucking with that. I will grab the knife and just very carefully snip that, very carefully snip that, like so. And this, I'm hoping, oh, I think I've only, they might have to snip both sides to get into there, and I have a funny feeling we might find some grills in here, and a... A serious booklet, it looks like it. We might actually get some serious instructions for the first... Look at this. That's a serious booklet. <laughs> so what's in the booklet? Is it for heavy, or do you think there's some... Oh, there is something. So let's see what he's got hidden in here. A little bit of fiddly to get the, the old brochure out. Wow. This is going to be something special. You can see we just... Oh, you're kidding. So oh. they, they even provide a CD. Oh, we must make sure we turn... Have a listen to that too. Well, that's... I've not seen that before. We've also got the level for making sure they're level. We've got some... If you want to just put... I'll actually do that while you do the rest of this. If you want, I'll do the... While you're doing the feet. Um, I'll pull some of these brochures out on the lounge and show how... Oh, look at this. So, they provide an actual booklet with the ranges and all the speakers and what's involved. They also provide another hi-fi review of some form, showing all the different specifications. Wow, and the making of it. We also have a certificate. Look at that. So signed off by the manufacturing and the acoustic check. Serial number. Again, handwritten on. And then we have a beautiful um, owner's manual it looks like it's been assembled like a business document it is very well presented oh wow and that is sensational hmm yes no 
this is very well presented and uh, uh, that's nice little touch they also have a CD that they'd like you so your first time listening they're providing you a bit of music that they obviously feel comfortable your first experience at home you can know that maybe this is the CD that they've been using um, have you heard of this group at all Benson? yeah same so I'm very keen to hear that to be honest with you so we've got to, we'll be firing up the CD player and we'll come back and uh, when we do the review on the Mydex I'll um, make sure that I've got the CD handy so we can have a listen to see what it is so and also you can see he's uh, unpacked the grills down on the ground there and he's just at the moment um, you can see here he's done one side but the other side will actually get on the video for you so you can see what they've done they've actually in the actual um, shipping um, they've provided them in the upside down position so he's, he's very cleverly so the spikes aren't poking out so he's now just taking that out He's just winding that down, and they've obviously got a bit of packaging between it to protect it. And then as it comes off, you can see the spike is down the bottom. So he's sliding off the, the bit of foam, and then he winds it out, swaps it around to the top side, so that he ends up getting it looking like over here. You can see he's just winding it down. He's left himself a little bit of thread down the bottom, where he just puts on his... And it's just really... It allows you to adjust how much spike comes out so if you're on a floor where there might be a little bit of variation in the floor um, you're in a position where you can do these adjustments and um, that's interesting so that's to do really the finish it's like this the cabinetry involved in this <laughs> I guess you know and if you I guess you know some of you will be thinking thirty thousand dollars that's a lot of money for speakers and to be honest uh, yes it is but um, when I was in my early 20s I bought a pair of high-end speakers and today to replace those I would be faced with spending $30,000 so this is sort of for me it's ticking a box off that I would love to fire these up and see this could be the new replacement for me but the finish is definitely outstanding are we ready now so which way are you going oh, we can go that so you're going to go forward and do we want a hand I'll put my hand on here so we just bring it down to the carpet and then he's just going to grab the top end. You can see he's just very carefully bringing it up. So you can see now it's sitting on the ground. We'll come round to the front. He's just taking the top piece off. And you can see they've got an elastic band holding the plastic. And look at this. Wow. <laughs> yes, no, this is fantastic. This is just fantastic. Look at that. Wow. Yes, yeah, so he's just now got the last little bits of stickers. We'll get those peeled off, like so. And the grill, if you're wondering, it looks like the grill on the front is pure glass. Here's one of those for you, and then another one down here. Let's get that for you. Very nicely done. And you can see he's just taking the tweeter plate off. And just so you can see, I'll get um, Benson just to take the front piece off. And it's it it's a solid piece of glass. It's a Certainly I've never seen a grill like this before. I mean, you can see in his hand, it weighs a bit, doesn't it? Yeah. So you can imagine, he's got a nice big thick piece of glass. And look at that. And then you can see him behind there, all the electronics, the speakers. Uh, just looks sensational. And I'm guessing, how does the grill work? You, you can. Ah! Okay, so you pop the grill. We're just While we're here, just, Benson's just identified that you either can have the glass grill with no, um, you know, actual fabric. And then the second one, if you bring the other one across, let's just pop that on and uh, see what that looks like. So here we go, we've now got a, a grill that now has no um, bits on it. And that actually, wow, and it locks in. So what we'll do is I'll we'll get Benson just to pull it over. I'll just slide it over. You might actually see if you get that pass there. Um, we're going to pop this beside the other one that we have sitting around and uh, you'll get to see one with this grill and one with the glass grill and uh, really this is sensational. Now if you'd like to find out more information about the Mydex you can duck onto hifihq.co.nz for New Zealand or hifihq.com.au for Australia and you can see he's just gently walking the speaker over and in the background you can see the other one that we've pre-unpacked and we've got one where we have the glass grill 
sitting on the front and here we have one with the actual fabric grill so he's just very gently bringing that and you can see over here this is a serious bit of weight to that and you've seen the packaging and the CD very well put together and you see on the ground here some of the extra bits so yes here we go so he's now sat them side by side and you can see here as we go from the bottom you can come all the way up and you've got one with a glass grill and one with a fabric grill and that just looks sensational well i hope you enjoyed today's unboxing of the mydex uh, floor standers these are just truly sensational and i will catch you next time on ab sound advice we'll just here's the rest of the audio physic range sitting in the background and again uh, we'll see you next time on ab sound advice